Okay, well, we don't have a show anyhow, so who cares if we start in a minute or start in an hour? We got nothing going on here tonight. The clock. And welcome to another welcome. Tuesday. This show took nearly 800,000 of nothing to produce. <laughs> 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 so I've come up with the five worst foods you can eat. Okay, now now I know this, 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 somebody's somebody's breathing is a little difficult out there. Who's having a breathing issue? Who's breathing in the mic? Yeah, five five worst foods. Okay, now let me see if any of you can say what what do you think the worst food you can eat is? So anybody out there? Uh, fried like the onion. K- the KFC fried chicken. Fried onion. That's one. Go on. What what chicken? Kentucky Fried Chicken. Kentucky, anybody else? A hot dog. A hot dog. Pizza is up there. T- for many, wow. You ever notice people in this else? market, they're drinking wheatgrass? I mean, wheatgrass. Uh, please. I mean, come on. Wheatgrass. They're grass. doing um, kale smoothies at Starbucks. Oh, I mean, that that's was number one. I heard about that. That was number one. <laughs> kale. Kale. Uh. <laughs> and you know why? They got to get people to eat that shit that used to be next to the hamburger so that the rest of us can eat the hamburger, okay? Right. Because <laughs> <laughs> if we everybody the hell ate the hamburger, they'd have a problem. That's why margarine was so successful. Yeah. So anyhow, that's where that is. And that's, that's, that's it. That's the whole funny show for the night, huh? No. <laughs> uh, Yay! Somebody, Story somebody about said. how you used to get margarine in the olden days. <laughs> oh, margarine? <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Grandpa Orange. Grandma. Come on, Grandpa Orange. Tell us a story. Margarine. Margarine. You know, you know what kept me from ever buying margarine? You, now, none of you are old enough to get up at 5 a.m. years ago, turn on the TV, and there was the farm report. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that was America. We used to have the I farm remember. report. I don't know about the yeah, I remember that. and I remember one time I turned up at 5 a.m. I'm I'm like a young kid waiting for the c- cartoons to come on, and they're showing this monstrous mountain of margarine sitting outside of a barn, talking about how we can make all this margarine, and we just have to add a little food color, and it looks just like butter. And I thought, okay, that's for other people. That's not for me. <laughs> <laughs> that's true. Oh, come on in, Box Talk Joy. <laughs> Bok choy, all the foods that we've learned to eat that we didn't need, you know. <laughs> we realize that our parents' generation, they're still alive at 90-odd years old, and they never ate anything good for them at all, okay? Hmm. Uh, all the way through. Are you kidding? So here's a, here's a comment from Wedded Bliss. The minute I walked into the post office, the postmaster noticed the new earrings my husband had given me. Those must be real diamonds, she said. Yes, I said. How can you tell? Because, she said, no one buys fake diamonds that small. All right. Yeah, that's true. Anyhow, so we have some comedy. We also have a, a really good musician, Nance Brody, who, if you don't know, Nan- Nance is really kind of very special. She's Canadian. She's gone through a lot of rigmarole in life and comes out making some songs that just make you very happy. So, I mean, it's very cool. Uh, all right. So now, what else are we going to do tonight? Let's see. Oh, the suit business. I can't, I can't believe it. You know, you know you, you, uh, maybe Hillary's going to wear one of those. Man, I wonder how much that blue suit costs. <laughs> <laughs> As long as it there are turn ten gold. things you should never say on stage, by the way. Just so you know, if you're coming up here, never say, we're having technical difficulties. Don't you hate when somebody says that, we're having technical You know, that to me is like, it's time for me to leave, You're right? We're having technical mm-hmm. difficulties. Yeah. Oh, and before I get to the next one, i got to tell you something. A doctor was telling me, he was on a flight one time, and somebody in first class, you know, got <clears throat> very sick or whatever. And the stewardess, who was brand new, got on the PA and meant to say, but because she was so nervous and so upset, said, is there a pilot on board? <laughs> she meant to say. 
Okay. Here's another thing. Never say on stage, I forgot the lyrics. Okay, that's no good. <laughs> Especially if you're singing a national anthem. <laughs> I want to thank my girlfriend, especially if you're married. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Never apologize on stage. Nobody wants to hear I'm sorry. You know, that's bullshit, you know? All right, don't do it. Yeah, don't say something like you get up and you're doing a show in Minneapolis. You go, you know, Minneapolis sucks. Right, thinking you're in a different city. That's not good. <laughs> yeah. This one's never good either. This song is about my grandma who died of cancer. Love you, Nana. That shut off the whole <laughs> audience. You can Ooh, forget about yeah. that. <laughs> Sad. Yeah. No doubt. Well, I'm broke. Yeah. And, and I'm not going to go through the rest, but how about this one? This has got to be the, one of the worst. How does it sound? Okay. I want to yell out, it doesn't sound very well. How long is the performance? Because <laughs> get off stage, <laughs> will you please? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So what's going on in the news today? The New York Times, I mean, it's unbelievable. Yeah. And it's, uh, let's see, they, there's a scandal. Oh, well, that's unusual in the paper, don't you think? She would have seen I'm glad right? I'm sitting down. You know. <laughs> New York libraries seek $1.4 billion from the city for overdue book that the mayor took. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> one point four million. How much you got? How much was it? One point four billion. Mm, no. Billion. Yeah. 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 Those fees really pile up. That's horrible. Yeah, that's really not good. Yeah. That has been dead about, for two hundred years. Yeah. Now, what about those eight hundred poor souls that uh, drowned trying to get from Libya to Italy? Mm. You know. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. So that's not so good. Yeah, here we got an SS soldier of Auschwitz admits moral guilt at trial. He's 94. <laughs> he's got about 13 seconds left to live. That's going to have to be the fastest trial ever. Guilty! <laughs> are you chicken I, look, I like looking at him and reading. All of those people are, that died are not me. Yeah. Did you Yay. like Chipotle Ch <laughs> serving uh, pulled pork sandwiches because they ran out of mean Nyman's pork? Right. Okay. What? Say it again. I like Nyman. What? Chipotle duck can They have no oh, currently pork, uh, whatever, sandwiches because Nyman's ran out of uh, the amount of pork they need. They, it's humane pork, okay? <clears throat> the pork really? is a red. Oh, really yeah, yeah. Humane sure. pork. And they're, they're lined up. And they're lined up. They're giving a little book about how life is and how good an afterlife is and how they're going to be. 70 virgin pigs in the future. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, no. I can't believe I'm saying this stuff. This is so sad. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Somebody else said to me today, they figured out that a $40 case, phone case, to protect your $500 phone from a five-year-old. Throwing it off a fourth-story balcony doesn't work. Ouch. <laughs> 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 well, you got to think about that. How many of you have your phone in a case, you know? And, I do. And, and you phone notice the people that have iPhones, they have to have a case that has a little hole in the back, so it shows a little apple. Like, oh, look at what I have. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I don't want you to you think it's a Samsung. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just put the apple on the case? I know. Uh, that's for poor people who can't afford a real apple. That's what I have. Yeah. I glued a little sticker on the back of mine that said, I wish I was an apple, but I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Yeah, I could put another sticker on it. You know, the last time somebody took an apple, <laughs> that's going to happen. a lot of trouble. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> you left your phone in a 25K suit. Yeah, exactly.